Aaron, when they bring in Mesa, it's pretty much a foregone conclusion. They're likely going to walk you there in that situation. But how badly do you want the opportunity to, to get an at bat in that spot? Oh, game on the line. You know, that's that's where you want to hit. You know, that's why I'm doing all the work to you know put my put myself in the position to go out there and you know help the team out and help us get a win right there. But you know, I trust every every single guy in our lineup and every single guy on our bench, and you know, especially the guy behind me, Anthony Rizzo. Who, you know, day in and day out throughout this whole season has always come up in big spots. But you know, today didn't do it, and I'll you know, show up tomorrow and get it done. You've been talking all year about how the first goal is to win the division. You guys had a shot tonight. Was that going through your head there at all as it's getting late? Not really. You know, we just focus on winning a game, you know, and then, you know, whatever happens after, then, you know, we can celebrate or not celebrate. But, you know, we treat every single game, you know, as if it was a postseason game, you know, first game of the year to even this, you know, game tonight. Nothing really changes. How quickly did you know when they made that pitching change that they will likely call the intentional walk on you? You, you never know. I, I don't think I've been hitting lefties well all year, so you never you never know what you know analytics is going to say. But uh, I think once they made the move, I kind of had a feeling. But you got you got to stay locked in in that position. You can't you know think you're going to get walked and all of a sudden you're you know, stepping in the box facing 98. So uh, yeah, I try to stay locked in until they tell me to move on. Did you feel any different, Aaron, with the, you know, kind of a different crowd than you've had the last six or seven games at home? You know, not everyone quite is invested in every pitch while you were at the plate. Well, nothing's like Yankee Stadium. Yeah, that's that's for sure. You know, I know the Rogers Center here gets pretty loud and pretty packed, um, but nothing like Yankee Stadium. But it, it felt just like a normal, normal game for me, just like the past couple of days. I don't know if the cameras are on you more, but there's you've been doing a lot of studying with the iPad, you know, looking at video. What are you looking for? But I just like checking out my swing and you know see what's going on and you know also kind of seeing where where certain pitches were you know you kind of have an idea where the strike zone is in your head and you just kind of like double checking to you know make sure you're right or wrong.